Hello guys and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be taking, well we're not going to be doing these bots, we're going to, I've got three brand new bots to show you guys and I'm going to show you how to make it with an updated version because last version I was actually a little bit incorrect but in this one I will actually be showing you how to get it properly correct so that all your animations will work because I've had a couple of complaints with the animations don't work and I've kind of figured it out thanks to this person on the screen right now thank you for explaining how to get the animations to work and for some reason my model's not this all right there is so what we're going to do you're going to get the model again link will be in the description for it again and you see that i've added three more parachute tigre uniform and bunny okay and all we're going to do is for this one i'm literally just going to remove the ones that we don't want so i'm going to remove pony i'll remove doggy and i'll remove alphys and also remove the other ones that we have which is going to be pony anime um Doggy anime and Alphys anime. I'm gonna remove pony, 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 um, doggy, 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 and then Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. So all I've got now is oh wait, I'm also gonna remove these well. Pony, doggy, and Alphys. So all I've got now is the ones that I'm gonna be using today. Um, one thing I am gonna do is um, first thing I'm gonna do. I'm not actually. I'm not gonna ungroup it yet. I'm not gonna ungroup it yet. I will take the models out of here, so I'll move the models into the workspace. That's the first thing I'm going to do. I'm going to put the models into the workspace like this, okay? Um, screen GUI, you can get rid of them if, if you, unless you're using another um, world. If, you, if you're not using the same world, screen GUI, or well, let's explain it again, goes in starter GUI. Um, the visible players goes in starter player scripts underneath starter player. And remote events goes into replicated storage, okay? Um, if you've already done that, and if this is the exact same world which it is for me, you can just delete them ones. You don't need them again, okay? You can also delete the instruction. I've actually added these now. This is explaining what you do in the um, if you can't, if you know what, if you um, this is explaining what you need to do if you haven't done it before, okay? But we have, so we're just going to delete that. And now we're left with everything that we're going to need for this, okay? We'll start work with Parachy, okay? We'll start with Parachy. And what we're going to do is we're going to grab Parachy now, okay? And you'll see that he's completely empty, other than the parts that he's going to be using. We're going to take a kill script, and the kill script is going to go into human on root part, I believe. I believe kill script goes into human on root part. I'm just going to quickly check on this part. I didn't check. So yeah, kill script goes into human on root part. We'll keep them closed down just to reduce space. So you're going to put kill script into their human on root part, okay? You're then going to take the chase script and just put that into their model. So it's just in that model right here with all the other parts in there. It's not in that side anything else. We're going to take their sound, which is going to be the Paracy kill. We're going to put that into the model as well, nowhere else. And you're also going to name Paracy kill swing, okay? Just like that. We're then going to take the three sounds, which is going to be Paracy hit, Paracy jump scare, and Paracy theme. We'll move that into Paracy hit. We're going to put his Paracy theme, or actually, we're going to put all three of them into human root part. And we're going to name them all now. So Paracy hit will be hit sound. Paracy theme will be ambience and Paracy jump scare will just be jump scare, okay? That is all the correct sounds I can show you right now. This is his theme. See so that's his theme and then you've got a jump scare. And then his hit sound. Like that, okay. We also want to make sure that their volumes are on one, which they're not. To make sure the ambience is on 0.5, yeah? I'm actually making it a little bit louder because these are quite quiet. That's a bit better, okay. So then what we're gonna, once we've got this, okay, guys, we're going to go into his animate now. So actually, we're going to find his... Wait, we haven't put his animate in yet. We're going to put Parachute Animate into here. What you're going to do now, okay, is you'll see that his animates are here. What you're going to do is you're going to open up Animation Editor and you're going to click Parachute, okay? You'll now see the animations will pop up, okay? There's three animations on here, idle, walk, and strike. If you just take the strike one first, you will see that his strike animation runs like that. You're just going to click the three dots and you can click export, okay? I'm going to call it parachute strike. Obviously, I've already exported it, but I'm going to just do it again, okay? You're going to do that, and then you're going to take this link, and you're just going to paste it into swing. If it was fine for you the first time, then you don't have to do this, but if it's not, you're going to paste it into swing right here. You're going to paste in a number just like that, okay? Then you're going to do the same thing for the other ones, which will be walk and thingy. All you're going to do is just go load, walk one, which will be the walk animation. Then you're just going to go export this one, parachute walk. And then you're just going to go into here, copy the link. And you're going to go into his animate source now, with the parachute animate. And you're going to find walk, open it up, and then go to click on walk animation and change the number again, okay? 
just like that. I'm not going to show you the idle one because mine already works. But then once you've got that, okay, guys, it will add. I uh, know oh it doesn't add a few more than mine. Then once you've done that, that'll pretty much be it for the parasy. We're going to take all three of these first because they're actually working bots. We're going to just move them off of there. These two aren't at the moment, so we can leave them there. Now we can test out parasies and see if his is working good and running. Okay. Here we go, so you can obviously hear their themes in that. See that he's chasing us, which is what we want. He got us, there we go, see? That's all working, that's all good. You will get you multiple times if he steps on your human root part. Where is he? There he is. Running to once more. There you go. So you'll see that Parachute works perfectly fine. We can now move on to Tigri. We're just going to move Parachute out of there. We're going to move on to Tigri and then we'll do bunnies. Okay, so Tigri. You're going to once again take the kill script. We're going to copy this one now. No, we're not going to copy it. We're not going to paste. Uh, we're not going to move it. We're just going to copy it. Okay, so we're going to copy it and then we're going to paste it in here. Control Shift V. To put the kill script in and that's going to go into his human root part. Okay. We're going to also take the chase script. We're going to copy that one. We just control C and then we're going to go into here and control shift V and leave that there, okay? We can then take his kill, his theme, jump scare hit, and his animate, and we can going to move all of these into his skin or into his model, and then we can move them into their correct place. So animate can stay there, and then all three of his bits of music can go into the human root part, and so can his animation stay here. Just remember to name it, rename it swing, and obviously change your animations again if your animations are wrong, okay? Remember to name the theme ambience, that's A M B I E N C E. His jump scare, jump scare, and his hit, hit, sound of a capital H and a capital T, set S. And once again, all you're going to do is click plugins, animation editor, and obviously we're at Parachute now. Click on Tigri, and then you'll just go here, export, and then you'll just do the same thing again that I did. I've already got them on here, so I'm not going to do it again. Once you've done that, that'll pretty much be Tigri done, actually. I'm going to move, mute her theme this time so i'm going to take her theme and i'm just going to make sure it's off playing there we go make sure it's on playing in that as well make sure that's working and then hopefully he should be good to go and we'll see this should load up into the game like that and then we've got tigri here there it is needs to be really slow oh there we go See, some some reason the theme is only playing after his attack, it's a bit weird. Stop, stop, stop. And that's a bit weird that he's really, really slow. I don't know why he's slow. I think that's just his walk speed. I'm not respawning either. Let me just reset. There you go. Oh, there we go. Oh, straight away. Is that going to win now? So he's, he's still bugging out. He's still... Yeah, there we go. So now I can see his jumps get properly in his theme and everything. See, that's all good. For some reason, he seems to be slow. I don't know if he is. Hopefully, that'll be working on that. There we go. He's got good jumps going that. He's got good, 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 good. That's all working. So now we're going to move Tigri out of here. Then we're going to do Bunny. Okay, so Bunny is. Not going to be very hard, we're going to just copy exactly what we did before. You don't even have to keep watching the video, just do the exact same thing for everyone. We're going to take all of these now. I'll put them all into Bunny and then we're going to put all them into place. So this one, this one and this one can go into the human root part. And you want to go to Tigri or any other person. And you just want to take the kill script and the chase script. Copy them. Then click on Bunny and then go Control Shift V again. Kill script into the human root part. Whoops. Kill script into the human root part. Rename the the bunny kill swing. Rename the theme. They'll rename this. Hit sound. On sound. Jump scare. You want to rename jump scare. And then obviously again, if you want to do, if you're going to do your animations, obviously I don't have to do it because mine are already in my inventory. Just click on a or go to the animation editor even click on bunny with bunny click on bunny and then do the export and all of that and it's not too hard okay 
what we can do then is I think we've got all that all done. Chase scripts, I don't know if you can change their walk speed. Um no, you can't change their walk speed, okay. Um no. Right, so what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna I think that's it, isn't it? I need to make this all done. Um theme, that's what we're gonna do. So theme, make sure it's on playing now. And 40, and then all we're gonna do is just go play here. And then bunny should be good to go, and it should be the end of the video I'm just gonna make sure I'm recording, yeah. Okay. So <clears throat> right. There we go, you see she starts chasing us. Theme's working and everything, that's all good. Yep, yeah, that looks good, that looks good, and then we're gonna just run into her. So yeah, it's all good. If if I think what run it, what happened in there is I've the crossbow is on can collide. And it like got in the way of the humanoid root part because it's when we touch the humanoid root part, which is what's on their stomach. So look, if I stand here, she can't get me because I'm touching her crossbow. It only happens when I touch the humanoid root part. So to fix this, it's really, really simple. Click on bunny, click on the right arm, and then click on the part inside of it, and just make sure that the can collide on it is off. That's literally it. Um, any other things that might be on can collide, you can turn off. And then there is anything else on can collide. Then all you're going to do is click play here. And hopefully this time it will go. The crossbow goes straight through you, so that it shouldn't collide with you, which will be good. So we're going to do is wait for it to load up, and there we go. And now we'll see if this works. See, up straight away. See, it's that easy, okay? Um, if you want to do it with your very own models, if you want to make your very own models into book uh, into bots, it's really easy. I can literally do it straight from a model straight out here. So if I select any skin now, I'm going to go giraffe. So yeah, I'll just do giraffe. And I'll take this one here. It's literally an is is literally an uninfected NPC. All you do is just take him, and then you go into his animation edit. Or actually, first you'd go into here. You see that everything that's there is what's in there. So all you're going to do then is just take the or oh, take the swing. Yeah, go Control C, go into Draft, and go Control V. I'm going to delete the other swing because that's going to be wrong. And then I'm going to go into the animation editor. And I'm going to go into Giraffe. And I'm going to import the ones that I've got in here already. So I'll take giraffe, 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 giraffe. Um, giraffe. There it is. Giraffe strike. That's the other one, isn't it? Um, on the other giraffe, the unaffected giraffe. I guess that'll be the one I've got on over here, won't it? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find the correct one. It is. is that it? Yep. I'm going to take the link here, which is going to be copy. And you'll see that, that works perfectly. And all we're going to do is just go into the animate thing, which is here the swing, and we're going to go into here, go control V like that. You're then going to just take an animate source or the animate, whatever it is, take the animate, take the chase script, take the sounds and jump scares and ambience, and then take the kill script and go control C, and go into drafting, go control V. Put them into the correct place, it's ambience, hit sound, jump scare, and kill script, all into human root part. Then you're going to put the animate, you'll obviously name it Giraffe. Giraffe Uninfected Animate. And then all you do is open this up, go into the animation editor, and obviously I have them here as well, so I'm just going to go into import. I'm going to import, and I'm going to go all the way down because this one's actually quite a long while ago. Uh, it should be here somewhere. Walk, is it that walk? No. Idle, no. Um, idle walk here, right? So this is going to be this walk. I'm going to copy this. You see that, that walk works perfectly. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to go walk here, walk animation into here, and then I'm going to take this and go Control V. Go back into here, and then I'm going to go import from Roblox. And I'm going to go all the way back down, find the idle one that was right next to it. Um, idle, 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 idle. So these ones were made ages ago when I first made this skin, and I'm going to go like that, that. Actually, I made a new one, didn't I? So I'm going to go import and make the better one. Um, I'll try and find it now. No, no, yeah, right, okay, I'm going to look for it then. I'm still going to look for it. I want to find this one. This one looks a lot better than the other one. Um, I think it's too far back though. When I did that one, yeah. Okay, we'll leave it like that then. That idol's fine. I, I did take it. Did I take this thing? I don't think I did now. I did it. No, I didn't. Right. 
And I'll go back down to idle again now, which is down further. Idle walk, idle there. Idle, take the link which is right here, go control C, submit, and then we're going to go into idle here, animation one. Put go into here and go control V. And that's going to be giraffe done, and then all you do is hit the sounds. So, obviously, you go to all jump scares, not all jump skates, all jump scares. Take piggy all jump scares, and then I'm going to go all hit, all hits. Take all the hit sounds, and then all I'll do is open up jump scares, and then I'll get giraffe It was giraffe Okay. Right, they only have the old one, so I'm gonna get rid of that. Then I'll take the hit sounds instead, and I'll do piggy bat is the one we want. So all you go, do is go down, take the sound ID like that. You're then gonna head into giraffes, go into his human root file, and take the hit sound and change the ID to be the same one that giraffes is. Okay. The ambience will be I'll do a giraffe theme. Giraffe theme. There we go. And then it's right here, and then we'll just take the amp, this thing again, we'll go to control C, delete that now. Whoops. Where have I? I don't know if I've got it now. Control C. Then go down to giraffe V here, jump uh ambience. Go to here, go control V, like that, and then you go Wait, is that tiger? Oh that's tiger. Whoops. Whoops, we need to go back on that. There we go, this is still same here. Let me go back up to giraffe. Is this giraffe? Yeah, this is giraffe, okay. We go into ambience and we go here, control V. Then we do his jump scare is the only one we've got to do now, and that's gonna be audio giraffe giraffe. And just click play here, and then hopefully, fingers crossed this time it is working. I'm gonna make sure I'm recording, yeah, and make sure I'm not on route on mute. Then all we're gonna do is once this has opened up in that. You see, he does start chasing us with the correct animations. Here's theme. See, he's all working, and we can test him. See, perfect. So, guys, actually, that is going to do it for this video. If you want to leave any other skins suggestions for me to add, I'll be adding a load of other skins into this game. But if you want to leave me, or into this model, I mean, if you want to leave me any skin suggestions for what you would like to see in this um, bot skin thing, if you, if you want to see any suggestions, leave them down, down below. I'll see what I can do about adding them. Um, I will make videos showing you how to make these ones. I probably won't show you how to make them all, I'll probably just say that there's an update. This is all you got to do. It's these three skins. Um, it might be four or five skins one day. Anyway guys, that is literally all, we, all for this video. Um, if you did enjoy, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to never miss another video. And I'm going to watch all of these just come in to me. And I will see you guys. Uh oh. I will see you guys in, oh my god. I will see you guys in the next time. Wow, they all just went for me. Parachute was first though, good parachute. I will see you guys in the next time. Goodbye.